Among the pages of the tablet, a call for Catholics to give back this season. It's called the Bright Christmas Campaign, an initiative started over 50 years ago so families in need can enjoy the holidays. And that's for you. Merry Christmas. And if we can provide them kind of with the, um, if you will, the tools or the ingredients to do that um, where they might not have those. Um, I, I think it's a, it's a very powerful thing. Anthony Butler is the executive director of St. John's Bread and Life Center in Bed-Stuy. The center is just one of dozens of groups and organizations who receive the donations. Each year the organization uses the money to help over 2,000 families create a Christmas kids will never forget. Those kind of, if you will, extra things they may not be able to do at Christmas, the, the toy for their child or the, or the nice meal. The center has already started collecting toys for this year's giveaway. But Butler says the generous donations from the diocese allows them to go the extra mile. It allows you to plan. It allows you so you do it much better, which I think is very important. It shouldn't just be throwing a toy and hoping a person likes it. Something Ellen Edelman from Families, Fathers, and Children, a ministry that helps the families of incarcerated men, knows all too well. There's a tremendous feeling that everybody wants their child to have a good Christmas. But this is for being a good girl. Thank you. The ministry, which operates out of St. Augustine's Church, also receives donations from the tablet. We're pretty much funded on uh, in-kind services and volunteer hours, so that something like uh, Bright Christmas can mean a lot to us. For these two organizations, they are thankful to the people of Brooklyn and Queens for their generous gifts. They know the power of the tablet campaign has helped to make many Christmases that much brighter. Merry Christmas. It's not just... You know, you give 20 bucks, 100 bucks, or $1,000. It allows you to participate in something. You're investing in something and participating in something. I think that's, that's very powerful. In Brooklyn, Katie Angusser, Currents News. Very good. Ho, ho, ho.